So my personal story with grief started when uh, my father passed away when I was a senior in high school. And what I would say to my younger self who really struggled with grief and that experience is that grief is a very individual journey. And you can't listen to the people who tell you that it's stages or who set you up with expectations that it's going to wrap up in a certain period of time because that's not how grief works and that's just not how emotions work. So the way that I would describe grief now to my younger self and to anybody who is starting down the, the process of grief recovery is to expect it to be a journey. There are gonna be days where you're very sad. Then there are gonna be days when you're really happy and things are gonna get better. And then you're gonna have a setback and be sad again. That's, that's just that cyclical nature of grief is just how, how you process things. And instead of looking at stages, you should look at the symptoms of grief. And the symptoms of grief are not just sadness. It can be anger. It can be anxiety. It can be exhaustion. It's a very, a loss is a huge thing. Dealing with the loss of someone you love is not something where you just shed a couple tears and move forward. It's a real process. It's really important to recognize that it's a process. And if you need help with that process, there are people around who can help you. And they can help you hold your hand as you go through that journey and as you move forward to a place where you can think about that person with love and with happiness and be sad that they're gone, but be okay and be able to continue to move forward in your life.